So we moved into this great building March 1st, 2020. And then as everyone knows, a couple weeks later, bam, the pandemic hit and COVID struck. So we actually used that time to get to know our office, to customize the office, to learn new software, to build and just get better at what we already had, to make sure that the team was a strong team, that we knew the ins and outs of our building, um, and we never had to close. We did shut down a couple of days per week. We weren't a full five days a week at that time. Uh, but we were three days a week. We kept going. We kept seeing the people that really needed us. Uh, we followed all the CDC guidelines as far as like disinfecting and sanitizing and proper mask wear and separating the patients. So we made sure everyone felt comfortable to come in here, that um, no one was around each other within the six feet. So we did everything we could to make it like a safe environment, but also keep people out of the hospitals just because of back and neck pain. We wanted to leave Leave the hospitals for the people that really needed it due to COVID and then come to us for the neck and the back and the headaches and the migraines instead of resorting to the hospital for drugs. And we also space out our appointments so that way they don't overlap where we don't have anyone waiting in the waiting room. We have three adjusting rooms and several treatment areas that we can separate and keep everyone at least six feet apart. Uh, so we often encourage people not to come in early for their appointments or late for their appointments. That way it doesn't interact with anyone else's previously scheduled appointment. So currently we don't take walk-ins due to the regulations, um, but we do accommodate everyone, including people that have lowered immune systems that perhaps need us to uh, see them during our lunch hours or before hours or after hours. So we really try to accommodate everyone and what they need so they feel comfortable and safe here.